Let's do some examples where we convert fractions to decimals. Here's a fraction, one-fourth, and the long division format of that would be one divided by four. Since one does not go, or four does not go into one, we're gonna add another zero by introducing a decimal point. And so we have to remember that the decimal point's gonna go directly above that. Four goes into 10 two times. Uh, two times four is eight, and we have two, and so we can drop another zero down here and see that uh, four goes into 25 times, and five times four is 20, and you have no more remainder. So one-fourth is actually equal to 0 0.25. Example number two. We have three eighths. We want to convert that into a decimal. So we have our numerator three, which is our dividend. And then our eight, our denominator, will become our divisor. So eight does not go into three. We introduce a decimal point at a zero. Eight goes into 30. It goes into 33 times, and that's 24. Uh, 30 minus 24 is 6. And so we have a, another remainder here, but we're going to drop another 0, add a 0, and then drop it down. 8 into 60, 7 times to get 56. And then a 4, so one more 0, drop down. 8 and go, goes into 45 times. And don't forget your decimal point. So 3 eighths is actually equal to 0 0.375. Example number three, four divided by 99. So we set this up again, four divided by 99. 99 does not go into four, so we introduce a decimal point and a zero. And uh, 99 still does not go into 40. So let's add a zero up here. The zero on the quotient is important. So we add another zero over here. And finally, 99 goes into 400 four times. Four times nine is 36. Carry three. 36 again, plus three is 39. And 400 minus 396 is four. Now, if we take a look at this, we drop a 4, we get 40, drop another, or drop a 0, we get 40, drop another 0, we get 400. That's the same as our original quotient. So it looks like um, if we follow along here, we're going to get a pattern that will go on forever. So we can say that 4 ninths is actually equal to 0 0.04, and the pattern is 0404. So uh, one way to denote that is to put a bar over the repeating decimals, 0, 04. Or if we want to approximate this, we can just say this is approximately equal to 0 0.04, round off to the hundredths place. So that is how you convert a fraction to a decimal.